In this video, I will show how to compute the probability of the standard normal random variable being in a given interval. When working with the standard normal random variable, also known as Z variable, the most important fact to remember is that all the answers to the questions of the form probability of Z being less than some value are recorded in what's, what, in what's called the Z table and can be found by looking at the intersection of the associated row and column. In our case, we have the question that's asking to find the probability of z being greater than some number. Since the inequality is greater than, uh, we cannot directly look in the table for the answer to this question. We have to first use the probability rule that says that probability of z being greater than some number is equal to 1 minus the probability of z being less than that number. Now we have probability of z being less than some number. So to answer this question, we look in the table and we look for the row uh, 1.6 and we look for the column with 0, 0.0. So if we look for the row 1.6 and the column 0, 0, we'll find the number 0.9452 uh, written in there. So that means the probability of z being less than 1.6 is 0.9452. So we can finish computing this expression. So the final answer to the original question is 0 0.0458.